the Black Lives Matter movement class is like a a showcase, an open house for the culmination of my own intellectual and activism. I see myself as an intellectual activist. I'm not an academic. Mm -hmm. uh, and so to be an intellectual activist means, though, that it is important to model what it means to be a community activist to my students. Again, some of them would just hear that I'm gonna rock a rally because, you know, I got to do it. And they would just show up and they were saying, you know, huh, well, we want an ethnic studies education that's relevant and real and, and, and about the movement, our movement. My new center could also be called the Center for Rehumanization. <laughs> See, I'm trying to rehumanize yes. people. I'm trying to rescue and reclaim your humanity. Absolutely. I'm trying to help us achieve a real multiracial, multicultural it's, democracy. And I mean right here, yeah. right. I ain't gonna wait. Yeah, I ain't yeah, waiting yeah. no longer. We are a part of a generation of professors and students at CU Boulder. Mm -hmm. We took Black Lives Matter very seriously. seriously. We transformed this institution that we love so much. And if I criticize CU Boulder, it's only because I love it. Yeah. See, it's a love, yes. it's constructive. Of we course. can be better. Of they course. talk about be Boulder, yeah. be better. Yes. I think Boulder could be better. Yeah. I think CU Boulder could be better. <laughs>